Hello, hello. We are going to Linnanmaki for the lights carnival that they're having. It's my first time and I'm so excited. that I've made him Jesus Christ that's how much damn we got in this game it is Saturday and I'm reading Kingdom of Us every page I emotionally prepare myself because you don't know what is happening and that doesn't seem like we are winning this war like at all so it's a struggle but we're getting there but i love it Eileen looks gorgeous planning to head out soon or soon ish there is a new light trail kind of like a tram uh, uh, line going on today so we would like to take that and uh, Fortunately enough, it leads to a yarn shop <laughs> or to a stop that is very close to a yarn shop. So I might pop by. You never know. Uh, but yeah, it would be fun to ride it. And I uh, will try to record a little bit of it. Uh, and sorry to you, might be the first knitter to do so, or at least the first that will try to knit on board uh, or crochet one of the, those two mm, no plans for the weekend really just like chilling and enjoying we have a lot of kind of like travel booking to be doing so we'll be doing that and today i did this eye look with no apparent reason other than i recorded a reel that is still up but uh, so far that is it i should also crochet like crazy to finish my uh, crochet test still struggling with that but getting there uh, very well so yeah nice sun <laughs> okay Temus Mittens that I made him uh, somewhere in 2017-18 stop waving your hands around <laughs> yeah I think I held uh, Tukuhul double in this blue because he likes blue, as you can see. So, yeah. Say hi, Demo! Hello. I myself am wearing this hat that I made 2017 and I haven't worn it that much ever since because I thought that it was too itchy for my head. But I decided to put it on today and it's actually not so itchy. Look at this pompon! Check it! And I'm wearing my lanes of uh, legs of uh, hearts, uh, soul, mini soul, by my friend Yannu, Kote Kotoni <laughs> on Instagram. Yeah, I will find the name of the hat and as usual I will put it down below. In my last vlog I had this starting um, scene of uh, during the evening, during sunset, uh, but had a beautiful lake but as you can see there's no lake now but we're gonna get a ice skate rink soon they have divine rivals at the bookstore 
I'm holding myself very hard not to buy it. Here is the new light rail, as they call it. Kind of like a tram-ish. So, tell me, what is your thoughts on the Line 15 light trail? <laughs> It's nice and very crowded on the first day, so uh, looking forward to seeing how busy it is on regular days. Mm -hmm. It's good. You don't realize how fast it goes on the it's... Yeah. It was nice and comfortable. Yeah. Like, we sat there as an old couple <laughs> going, going places and now enjoying a little bit of hot chocolate and coffee on the way back home. This is the light trail that we got. Go in the other direction. chocolate it is very nice it's exceed expectations that's a nice smiley face on the cup mm. and we and we just noticed that Temu's cup has a kissing face a whistling face Temu says that this tastes like Coca-Cola, uh, but with apple, and actually has one of the cutest packaging that I have ever seen. Not sponsored, we're buying this with our own money. <laughs> I just pet it the cutest, smallest dog in this world. I was just casually updating my Instagram and turn around and I see the smallest, cutest white fluffy dog so you could feed it in my hand and I don't have big hands the owners were very kind enough to let me pet her she was so cute she made my day good morning good morning or good day because it's two o'clock on Monday and I'm just heading out to return some books to the library and then I have a haircut with my lovely hairdresser and friend, Anna. Uh, and I was just thinking how pathetic I would be if I start crying because the series I was just reading, I finished them. Throne of Glass has taken my heart out of my body, stumbled upon many different ways and left it to shreds. I will be thinking for a long, 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 long while about the series. It's like truly magnificent. Think about it now, that makes me want to cry. I will hold myself. Ah, but yeah, just chill. It was, it was very, very, very nice. And I have no idea what I'm gonna be doing now with my hair. I think I might go like to what I did in August that were a little bit shorter but I want to discuss it with Hannah and see what she thinks and we'll decide together I'm wearing my Harriet bonnet and my sofa scarf and inside like a scrap uh, my scrappy um, crochet sweater from Caroline uh, I'll put everything in the description hopefully I will manage we have a comprehensive vlog one vlog once again. Outfit check as best as I can. <laughs> the 
honest, to be honest, I thought it was going to be colder than it is. Well, I am wearing double tights. <laughs> one a little bit like thinner on the inside and one with cashmere on the outside. But I'm wearing a very short skirt, <laughs> therefore I needed the extra coverage. But I think it's going to be colder like towards the evening, so not as bad. But yeah, I'm very happy, especially with this. Uh, this I should do one more I have decided and now I know where to, to, to stop for the solder uh, like I have a reference point now so I can make it a little bit even better <laughs> uh, I've been wearing it a lot since I made it it was one of my first makes for 2023 I was very happy with it so I think I will try to experiment with another one as soon as I have a little bit of more empty needles and hooks around just endless rumbling, don't mind me. <laughs> Even though recording in public can be a little bit embarrassing, I still do it. I'm in downtown Helsinki, and I've forgotten how much I love it. Uh, but I'm not coming often enough nowadays, uh, but I do love it. It's so nice. I'm also wearing more color than the average fin does so that usually earns me quite a lot of stares from people walking by but we smile through it Out of my haircut, we went a little bit of more of a French vibe. I super super loved it, especially like with like under the ear. Oh, it looks so cool! I'm so excited. Christmas mugs are my downfall, and I want multiple of those. I am a sucker for Christmas mugs. And this one proved it, but look at it. I have a whole collection of Christmas mags. Maybe closer to Christmas I should show them to you. But I super love them, and it's not the only one that I'm gonna be buying. <laughs> go to sleep it's to take it off some of my makeup and maybe get rid of some of the hair <laughs> on my face from the haircut uh, I just realized that I don't think I have ever had shorter hair like that time in August and now this is the shortest hair I have ever done and I have short hair most of my life I kind of sometimes I do miss my long hair because it has a little bit of more possibilities on how to style them, but yeah, like this length, I'm kind of like in love. And we did like my hairdresser Hanna did like this thing that is like shorter, so I can completely be French. It's such a vibe. Anyways, or can you do it? see it more here? Yeah, you can see it more here. I could did. No, I ruined it. This, that it's shorter than the rest. Honestly, it looks so good. I'm obsessed. I just want to have this length, but it's quite hard to maintain. Because then you need to be at the hairdresser every like 20 days. So, yeah, it's not, not very possible. But I love it. I'm so French. Ooh, it's like completely flat. Ooh, such a French vibe. Okay, I'm rambling now. Should take off my makeup and go to sleep.
all of them and glowy and for me that's good night and there's closing of this vlog i will see you in the next one bye no okay I like this is not the end but hi from the oxy with hair pajamas i just want to say a little bit about what i'm currently reading i'm reading the summer i turned pretty i'm in page 47 and it's yeah i know it's your typical uh summer going to a cottage every summer and falling in love with the boys that they're there but i'm not gonna uh doom it from, from the beginning i'm gonna read and like i say but it's like a nice relaxing read i just finished this morning the throne of glass series i read the last pages of um of kingdom of ash and the emotional damage that i have gotten from this book it's out of this world it is crazy i yesterday was just reading here and my boyfriend was like doxy we need to go to sleep like we need to stop at some point and i was like yeah 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 I need to get this over with and then I uh, need to sleep and then of course like because I got too much invested into the book then of course I couldn't like stop thinking about it and I couldn't like fall asleep easily but yeah okay that's what you get for reading uh, <laughs> even though I was feeling very sleepy um, and I actually cried <laughs> and uh, my boyfriend broke my tissues and this morning I was reading like some of the pages, like one of the most devastating scenes. And literally I was like, no, uh, I read like, and started and said like, no. And I was like, and I started crying. Yeah, uh, I cry a lot <laughs> and I cry a lot with books, even though I know that the characters are not real. Any of those that is happening is not real, but I get too much invested. Uh, yeah. And then I went to cry, as I said in the beginning, in, in, the, in the morning of today, I went to cry because this book is was over, like the whole series really holds a special part in my heart. But now I'm going to be reading a little bit and hopefully feel sleepy enough <laughs> so I don't pull like a little bit more of what I did yesterday. So, yeah, I kind of enjoy actually, I, I realized that I kind of enjoy filming vlogs and taking you along with me in the reality of my day so that's why I, I keep doing it even though I say that I'm not very good but uh, if you don't practice how it's gonna be becoming better and better because I don't think practice makes perfect but practice makes things going forward so yeah with this lesson kids I'm gonna be leaving you to read my book and yeah I'm gonna see you in the next one bye